Weather on the Tens from your Northwest Arkansas Weather Authority. This morning, southerly winds at around 5 to 8 miles per hour will only get a little stronger through the morning hours and then become windy for later on this afternoon. And so windy and very mild temperatures on the way. Right now, for the most part, we're clear. There are just a, a few areas of some low clouds out there this morning. Uh, we will probably see an increase in clouds. So at times, we'll go broken cloudiness uh, with some patchy sun. And then at times, we'll be uh, a lot more sun. But high temperatures today making it back into the low to maybe middle 70s. So here's the outlook. Temperatures right now now in the 50s this morning, rising into the upper 60s, low 70s over most areas, 80s out to the west of us. Notice the cold air kind of get pulled up here uh, to our north. Tomorrow, high temperatures will be in the lower 70s once again. I think tomorrow, uh, low clouds will be around us, and there is some potential. We may not get into the sun, and if we don't, we might be colder than this, but look at the 47 degrees in Kansas City for tomorrow afternoon. There is some colder air right there along the little band, and that little band uh, where the cold air and warm air meet will be thunder showers along this little area over central parts of Missouri. That uh, area of rain will move off toward the south and will give us some rain showers and thunderstorms tomorrow night into Saturday morning. Temperatures start the day out Saturday in the low 50s, so not a really a bad start for Saturday morning, but the cold air advances. So, so through the day, look at the temperatures drop. Cloudy skies continuing for a large part of Saturday and probably ended up somewhere around the mid 40s. So, how's that for a chilly Saturday after the balmier weather we've had here recently? So, uh, that will be a chilly weekend. A light freeze is coming as we go into Sunday morning. Right now, just uh, showers and some light thunder showers south of St. Louis. A little system is coming through, and there's a little area right down in here that has the potential for some lift. So, uh, as you see this go by us, there's something right in there that is south winds begin to increase, that could cause a few showers to pop here uh, over the southern part of Missouri and northern part of Arkansas this morning. All right, otherwise, we're going to be watching back up here. Uh, this is a cold front here. And so right in this area, I think, is the best chances for thunderstorms that will start to develop here, what well, looks like right now, actually, right there along the cold front, and they'll drop off toward the east, southeast, toward Kansas City, along Interstate 70. And again, there's those areas of showers that's possible here in the northern part of area this morning. All right, so we'll be watching for that. Models pick it up, too. Watch that. Right in there, there's a little bit of shower potential. There's a cluster of storms moving across northern Missouri. Again, this is that Missouri River that's in flood. Uh, there's more storms clusters. That's tomorrow at around lunchtime. Those are pretty intense storms. Cold front starts to drop south, giving us some increasing chances for shower storms tomorrow evening. 74 today, 64 to 70 on Friday. It really depends on how much sun we get on Friday. And then colder air will rush in on Saturday, and so temperatures will drop from the low 50s into the 40s. And then a light freeze coming Sunday morning with morning lows in the upper 20s. And high Sunday only in the low 50s. So uh, this marks the, well, you know, like they were saying at, uh, at the garden center that mm -hmm. you may want to hold off on the annuals. Most plants are fine, yep. but there are some plants that have, that have pushed out some leaves. Right. You may want to consider covering, covering those on Sunday morning and also on Monday morning. And you're saying even that one day of temperatures below freezing, if those plants aren't covered, that could... Yeah be a catastrophic issue. Most plants that are out now are fine, okay. but some are pretty tender. Right. And uh, I'm, uh, I, uh, you know, I can't think of what they would be, but right. um, you know, maybe some of the hostas, you know, that hostas? might be kind of pushing, pushing up. So yeah. That was anyway. a hosta. Hosta is a little plant that grows some really cool leaves oh. um, that uh, you typically find in shade. Well, you can tell I have, I'd have no to show you. plant knowledge whatsoever. No, I get you. I get you.